Hello everyone, and welcome to a brand new Engines of North America video. Today, we will be talking about the engine that truly started the diesel locomotive's ascension, the EMC FT. The FT was first developed by the Electromotive Corporation a few years before it became a division of General Motors. Where the EA was designated for passenger service, the FT would be used for freight. It was a stroke of genius for the Electromotive Corporation to show off a demonstrator ABBA set in 1939. Their success would be the first nail in the coffin of the steam era. The FT will be built from November of 1939 through World War II to November of 1945. One thing that's interesting is that unlike future F units, the FT's A and B units were semi-permanently coupled via a drawbar in between each unit, as opposed to a traditional knuckle coupler. F and FT stood for freight, and I wasn't able to find what the T stood for. I presume it stood for something on the line of test or trial. They had a top speed of 65 miles per hour, a starting tractive effort of 55,000 pounds, and a continuous tractive effort of 40,000 pounds. This unit ran on a B-B wheelbase, weighed in at 230,000 pounds, and internally, each unit came built with two 567B 16-cylinder engines, each unit measuring at 50 feet 8 inches, and for the whistle, the FT came built with a Leslie a200-156 horn. Just under two dozen North American railroads ran the FT diesel locomotive. These include, but are not limited to, the Reading, Western Pacific, and the Chicago, Burlington, and Quincy. The railroad with the most FTs was the Santa Fe, with a grand total of 160. The Great Northern came in second with 51, and the Southern came in third with a total of 38. FT was just the beginning of the diesel revolution. With over 1,000 units sold by 1945, this would pave the way for the future successful F units such as the ever popular F3 and F7. However, only five of the original FTs would make it into preservation. Today, five FT engines have been preserved throughout North America. These include, but are not limited to, Northern Pacific A Unit number 5401, which is preserved in Mexico at the Puebla Museum, Demonstrator A Unit number 103, which is located at the National Transportation Museum in St. Louis, Missouri, and a Demonstrator B Unit number 103B, which is located at the Virginia Museum of Transportation.